Hey YouTube, it's All Things Pretty. I'm coming to you with a quick video. I wanted to share with you a few items that I purchased and um, primarily to share with you some things that I purchased from this website that I've been stalking. And let me see if I can show that name to you without sharing my personal information. The name of the website is called Blitzy and it's blitzy.com and basically if you're not familiar with Bit blitzy basically it's a website where you are um, have the opportunity to purchase some you know select items or um, high demand items for um, a fraction of the cost and they're only on sale for a short period of time which is why I guess they have the name Blitzy because once they're out, they I guess they call it they're blitzed out or um, in other words, sold out. So they might be on sale for a week or they might blitz out in a couple of hours depending on what the items are. So um, what I purchased from Blitzy was the um, Heidi Swap Color Shine and I got Black Velvet Teal, Sweet Cherry, Georgia Peach, and Bronzer. And these were actually on the Blitz special for $3.99. So you can see that there. And I paid $5.95 for shipping which I think was a pretty good price because at my Michaels, um, the Heidi Swap Color Shine Sprays are $5.99 a bottle, so about six bucks times the five that I purchased is $30, so I still made out well even with paying the $5.95 for shipping. So I'm really pleased about that and I'm really excited about that and I cannot wait to give them a try. Oh, I'm filming with this webcam again, so I don't know what you're going to see. Um, I don't know. You might hear the conversation next week, but see the face now. So we'll see what happens. Hoping for the best. All right. The next few things I purchased were from Michaels. And I got this rubber stamp. And this one. And then I purchased three of these. These are the smash bands, the Hello Kitty smash bands. And these were on clearance for $1.49. So I got whatever they had left so that I could gift or give or, you know, I'm not sure yet, but I don't have a need for six bands, so they'll be going somewhere. And then I purchased this corner punch. This is what it looks like. And it was on clearance for $2.99. So that is my haul from Michael's. Then I went on line to Zibit and I don't use that website much. I'm actually just now really, I guess, um, getting hip to the website, but I got some lace um, and I was really excited about this purchase because each of these laces, it's about four yards each and I have this mint green, which I don't know if you can tell the color that's not really helping but anyway I have this mint green I have um, pastel pink I have purple and I have um, a cream lace color and all of them have about four yards each and they were like 62 cents for the four yards so um, with that and shipping for this bag of lace I paid about five dollars so really stoked about that the only thing is, um, I want to go back to the young lady that I purchased from, but she didn't include a card or anything or my receipt or anything, so I don't remember who I purchased from. What else do I want to show you? Oh, I want to show you um, what I'm making for my candy station. I decided to make a candy station. And so um, here is the candlestick holder. And then I use these trays from Michael's. So I have um, two of these short ones, and then what I did was 
Use E6000 to glue two of the long ones together. I mean, two of the candlesticks together to make one long one. And then I put the tray on it. So I have two tall ones in one short one. And then I have two more of just the trays, but I need the candlesticks. So that's another project that I'm going to be working on. Speaking of projects, I have one more project that I want to share with you guys. Just hang on one second. I'm coming, guys. Okay. Here we go. So I am really excited about this. Really, really excited. But I saw, I think it was S Crafter 1. S, S Crafter 1, and I'll put her information in the link below. But she had these um, bobbins or thread spindles, and she turned them into a way to store her lace. And so when I saw the idea, I fell in love with it, and I wanted to give it a try. So I wanted to share with you what I came up with. So this one, let's see what this light is going to do. So I have this blue and white one. And then in the center, I have a blue drawer pull that I just stuck in the hole. And so this one is blue and white, and I love it. Then I have this one here, pink, green, and white. And I really hope you can see this because this lighting is not working with me. And then I just put the pearls on the bottom. And I have this yellow one. And it looks red, but it's like yellow and hot pinkish. And then I have this drawer pull on the top. And I got the drawer pulls or door not drawer knobs from Michaels. And I have two more. I have this one here, pink and green. And I have this one, white and pink and like a reddish pink. Not really sure what you call that color. And I have a little piece of lace already stored on here. I was just trying to see what it would look like. So I have my bouquet of spindles. So hopefully you guys can see those. That's what they look like. And I'm really, really proud of them. I'm excited and I can't wait to store them and to get all my lace on there. And um, yeah, I think that's about it. I do have a project that I wanna share with you. I was in a Your Paper Pantry swap with Domino Books and I'm ready to share those. Um, I received mine. I've already sent mine out and so I didn't do a video though. So I'm sorry guys. But I think that's it before I start to ramble on for another five minutes. Thank you all for watching. And I look forward to seeing you next time.